Listen up, you Kentucky Fried Slice of Taint. Hey, what do you hear? What do you say? My Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Google Plus, your sister's ass, the Pony Express. Yes, I know there's no Google Plus. There's no more Pony Express either. It's a joke, you fucking morons. This isn't a ticked off Vic, but I'm pretty ticked on the inside. I'm just calling out someone who deserves it. And I rarely call out specific politicians, but I am fucking through the roof on this one. So I'm going to go for it. I don't give a shit if your politics is blue, red, green, yellow, or purple. I don't care if you're a conservative or a liberal or a libertarian or a vegetarian. I don't care if you're left, right, up, down, sideways, or reverse. But I do care when you're a shit stain and you go after my home, my people, my New York. I'm talking to you, Mitch McConnell. Listen up, you Kentucky Fried Slice of Taint. You might have fooled a whole bunch of people in your state, but don't you ever fuck with mine. I'm born and raised in Brooklyn. We New Yorkers have a special kind of bond that comes from growing up in the greatest city in the world. Because if you can make it here, you can make it anywhere, baby. It's not just in a song. When you come from New York, you can handle anything, any fucking thing. And New York is one of the engines that drives this country. And we have been an engine since we evolved from a bunch of musket-carrying farmers into the greatest country in the world. We were a big city when your grandpappy was still shitting in holes in the ground. This is what McConnell said a couple of days ago, and even Republicans said that this is really wrong. Mitchie Boy said the blue states should not get bailed out, that the blue states should file for bankruptcy. First of all, if you don't know what declaring bankruptcy would do for a state, how horrible it would be for police and fire and all the public services that are provided. Then go use your Google machine and go learn something. Second of all, I'm so fucking sick and tired of this blue state, red state bullshit. Don't you realize that there is no state that only votes one way? So there are red states that might have 49% Democrats or vice versa. What are you going to do? Shit on an entire state because they have slightly more blue voters than red? That's how you take care of the red voters? And these are all American citizens who need help. Stop it already with the divisive bullshit already. You are such a fucking awful, disgusting person. Here's the reality, Mitch, Mitch Shitstein. Kentucky receives more federal funds than it pays back to the federal government every year. Kentucky receives more federal money than every state except two. Guess who's on the opposite end of that spectrum every fucking year? New York, New York pays more in taxes to the federal government than they get back. They are number three behind New Jersey and California. That's right. We pay more to the government than we get back. You, on the other hand, mooch from the government every single fucking year. And so the reason why Kentucky gets all this money is to give their residents is because of New York and the other states like New Jersey and California. Year after year after year. New Yorkers get up every fucking day and fight traffic and overcrowding and go to work for this country. What do you do every day, you mint julep drinking fucking ghoul with no chin? Now look, I have nothing against the people of Kentucky. Why would I? I love the Kentucky Derby. I used to love the Kentucky Colonels with Louis Dampier and Artis Gilmore and Dan Eisel, Eisel, whatever the fuck his name is. I love bluegrass. The people of Kentucky don't bother me, and I don't bother them. But Senator Sacco shit opened a can of fucking worms. Who the hell are you kidding, you partisan pot of piss? Have you ever had a job, you turtle-headed taint licker? No. But you're going to sit there and play games with people's lives and money that New Yorkers need now because you're going to play the lib blue conservative red game bullshit? If it wasn't for all the states that work hard and make shit happen, you'd be catching crawdads at the fishing hole while banging your sister's brother's aunt, you backwards ass bag. Don't you fuckers fuck with New York because we are down right now. That shit will come back to bite you in the fucking ass someday because we will be back. We will remember what you sons of bitches said and what you tried to do. We are the United States of America. And you are actually trying to take advantage of how states get help in the middle of a pandemic. 
by playing party politics? With my fellow New Yorkers' lives and livelihood? I don't think so. You're a fucking ghoul, you shit pipe. You have been the single worst virus in this country. Leave the people and the state and the city of New York alone, McConnell. Now go strap on your truss, rub in your hemorrhoid cream, put in your teeth, and go get your fucking shine box.